Okay, so to recap our little experiment here, we use Saran Wrap, Preparation H, Castor Oil, and Vicks Vapo Rub. My husband's part was the Vicks Vapo Rub with the Saran Wrap. He, we did it at started at six o'clock p.m. and wrapped two layers of Saran Wrap around him and then he put a compression shirt on, which you can see it's kind of tight, um, to try to hold it together. And he went to the garage where it's nice and hot and um, put a heating pad on for two hours. So from- Sat and just watched TV. And he just sat and yeah, he did nothing. So from six to eight, he had a heating pad on trying to activate you know, the heat to it. Um, and let's see how he did. Okay, so the wrap kind of stayed on. I'm not going to show you what my belly looks like because it don't look nothing like that. But I could see um, redness there, so that might be a problem. Um, we chose him to do the menthol or the cast the. the it had a slight burn to it, but almost like peppermint in your mouth. You know, not like oh my god, I can't stand this. It just tingled with a little bit of heat. And if I would have done that, I would have had that wilt. I would have had it all around my body. So yeah, take it off. Does it feel wet or anything? Yeah, the inside almost feels like melted sticky, but I can't find the, the end. Found it. Okay. Okay. So yeah, that, ugh, yucky. So I don't know if you can see this. Um, there's liquid on his stomach. Okay, so we will uh, dry off his belly and then measure him out. Okay, so he started out with a 48 inch circumference and he ended with a 47 and a half. So we basically lost a half of an inch, an inch of fat over a three hour period, turns out ways. Um, I'll insert still photographs um, afterwards. Um, cloth and then laid it right here on my stomach and then I um, also did preparation H and rub that all into my body and then we did two wrappings of the saran wrap that within minutes fell off it like it was sliding all the way down on my back so I had to have two more wraps done and it was because I was staying active so my method was to like you know work out or do um, cleaning the house and you know to stay active in that sense so that's what I did to make mine active so um, we'll see what mine is okay so I lost a whole inch with the method I use so I would definitely say that if you're going to whether, whether you use the castor oil the uh, the preparation age or the Vicks Vapor Rub be active. The the method of just having a heating pad didn't seem to you know garner as much loss. So my husband lost a half inch using the um, Vicks Vapor Rub and heating pad, and I lost an inch doing activity for two hours and then sitting for one hour. So we were both had it on for three hours, and um, the preparation H and the castor oil had me lose an inch. Um, so I would definitely say stay active. Now the next time we're going to try this, I'm going to have my husband, I, I can't do the Vicks Vapor Rub because he had a reaction to his stomach. I guarantee you that would be all the way around and up my head. So um, with him, we're going to do the castor oil and the preparation H. Maybe that is a better um, method in general. Um, and so we'll do a controlled measure of having him do that and then two hours with the heating pad in the garage kind of thing. And then our final measure will be whatever one won out of those, um, having him then be active for two hours and see if that's actually the biggest thing is, you know, sweating and getting your body moving. So thank you guys for watching and we'll share with you the next round.
Okay, so today we are starting at 1.30 in the afternoon. We're going to go for three hours. Today's experiment is my husband is doing what I did yesterday with the Preparation H and the fabric that has um, uh, castor oil on it. We did a thin piece of fabric right here. So it went all the way around to his love handles. See? And to the other side and um, in the stomach area. So we're hoping by targeting those areas with the castor oil, that will target the um, you know fat area to burn off. Uh, wrapped him three times in- The front. Three times Two in the front, the twice in the back, with um, saran wrap. And today we are just gonna go to the grocery store and he's not gonna be very active, just mild activity. Whereas yesterday he did the Vicks for three hours, two hours with a um, heating pad, and no activity whatsoever. For one hour, he just sat in his man cave and played video games, which is very common. Anyway. <laughs> um, and, oh, and, okay, so yesterday he started out at 48 inches. By the time we were done with this experiment with the Vix Vapor Rub, he had lost a half inch. He was 47 and a half. Today, after breakfast or brunch, he is now 47 and three quarters. So his net loss is still a quarter of an inch um, from yesterday. So hold on and we'll see what I am. Okay, so today I'm having to do the same thing that I did yesterday because I, I cannot use the Vicks Vapor Rub. If my husband broke out, I would be a complete wilt. So I cannot use that, so I'll never use that. But I have the Preparation H, just like I did, and I have the, um, the pad of castor oil um, on my belly fat here. Um, redoing the inches after brunch, I am 56. I ended at 59 last night, 55 last night, so I'm exactly where I was when I started this yesterday. So I have no net loss, even though I had a one inch loss from last night. And I think I did it last night before I ate dinner. So that could be a difference, I'm not sure. Um, and let's see what else. So we'll, we'll share with you in three hours what, oh, and, and my activity. Yesterday, I cleaned the house and was really, really active. And then I had one hour of the, um, the heating pad on my stomach. So today, I am just gonna go to the grocery store, just be a normal activity, I'm not extreme you know, activity. So thank you so much. We'll share the final results with you in a few hours. So in conclusion to our little experiment here, I wanted to share with you the following. Um, my husband, just to recap, yesterday he lost a half inch by just being sedentary, sitting in a hot garage with a heating pad on his stomach with um, being wrapped in saran wrap and Vicks Vapor Rub. He um, spent two hours in the garage with the heating pad on and then one hour in the man cave doing nothing. So he was completely sedentary and he lost a half inch using that method. Today we switched it up and he used the Preparation H, um, rubbed that all in and put the pad of castor oil around his stomach and hips. And he lost one inch and he was, semi, he was, he was sedentary for one hour and then semi-active for um, two hours when we went grocery shopping and you know just errands like that. So overall, it seems as if in his case, um, the uh, Preparation H and the castor oil definitely worked better. Um, I think if he would have probably, um, if we would have done, done grocery shopping, if he would have spent that one hour having the um, pad on him, the heating pad, he probably would have lost even more. So um, in my case, uh, I used the Preparation H yesterday along with the, um, the pad of castor oil and I lost an inch last night. But then I woke up today and it was magically gone. However, I felt like my skin was tighter. So I was shocked that when I measured out that I was measuring that I was before I lost the inch yesterday. Um, so it's a matter of his perspective there on the um, measurement with my husband. But um, I felt like my skin was tighter. So I think this Preparation H stuff actually tightens your skin even when you're done. I think the cream is still in there and I think it's tightening up your skin. So it felt better. However, I started out where I was yesterday and I also weigh, or measured after I had had brunch. Whereas yesterday I measured before I had dinner. So that's, you know, I'm sorry that's not an accurate description. My husband's case, it is accurate. Um, so today I did the castor oil again with the Preparation H. 
um, I was a little less active than I was yesterday. I went to the grocery store, like I said, and then did some light vacuuming. So, um, but I still lost one inch. So overall, I've lost one inch just doing um, the, the method that I did, the preparation age with the castor oil. My husband has lost an inch and a half. Only a half inch from the first method and an inch from the second. So I think we overwhelmingly agree that the preparation H and the castor oil pad is the best way to go. Um, the more active you are, the better. Um, using a heating pad if you're not going to be active. Um, my biggest problem with it is because I've got a lot of curves going on, so it kept rolling up and rolling down. And that uh, we're both kind of convinced that by the plastic rolling up and down It's not grabbing around and making you sweat in the areas that you're losing trying to lose weight at the only place that it stayed on at was directly on the front of my stomach where that um, Castor oil pad was that I had so um, I think and I think it's just because I'm just too active I can't sit I can't stand I just have got to be moving all the time So if you're gonna do this wrap I wrap myself four times really tightly my husband wrapped myself four times really tightly if you're gonna do it either stand up and walk and just stay active don't sit down or if you are gonna be one that has to sit down and just use the heating pad because you can't get around um, just lay down don't sit up don't sit down don't do a bunch of stuff just lay down put the heating pad on and um, it'll work just not as well as being active with a lot of sweat so thank you guys for watching our experiment um, we are newbies when it comes to keto or seven days in and um, we'll be doing this again probably next weekend and sharing our keto experience and try to burn fat as much as we can thank you guys so much for watching